Hi, I am Yusuf, freelance graphic designer. Today I will show you how to edit Illustrator template, like text editing, replace images, color change and ready to file for printing. Firstly you need to make sure that Adobe Illustrator is installed on your laptop or computer. If not, please download the software from www.adobe.com and install it. and extract the zip file. Then you will find two types of files. One is for the design template and others are for the help file. Open the help file. You will find the download link here. Copy the link and open it in your browser to download the fonts. After downloading extract and install the fonts in your computers. Now we will start to learn how to edit the template. Open your Adobe Illustrator. This is the view of Adobe Illustrator. You can see the menu, tools, panel here. Now go to file option, then click on open and select your template. This will open your file in the Illustrator. How to edit text. If you want to replace or edit this text then need to open character panel. I'm opening character panel, so go to the window, then type and click on the character. Now select the type tool and make a selection of the text and type or paste here. You can control the text size, style from the character panel. Follow me how I'm doing this.
How to replace images. If you want to replace images then need to open link panel. I'm opening link panel, so go to the window then click on the link option. I will see four images here. First select direct selection tool. Click on the image. Then go to the link option and click on relink. Now select the image click on place. Follow me how I'm doing this. How to change color. If you want to change color then select all objects, short key control plus A. When all object is selected then go to recolor at work. And change the color easily. How to ready file for printing. When your file is ok, and you want to make it ready for printing then you need to save the file as PDF format. To do that go to file. Click on save as and select Adobe PDF. Now select high quality print, click on marks and bleeds. It's most important for printing. To check the trim marks and bleed then click on save. That's it.
I hope this tutorial helped you. If it is useful to you then like, comment and share with your social media and friends. Also, if you want more latest tutorials then subscribe now and press the bell icon. Take care and keep learning.